All right. Welcome to the Pentagon. I'll be escorting you to the conference room with all the military generals to talk about God who knows what. That's above my pay grade, so enjoy. Yeah, I'm here on a very important business thing. All right, this way, sir. Hmm, should I have chicken or beef tonight? Uh, well, yeah, that sounds like a pretty interesting mixtape you uh, presented to me. Well, the reason I'm here is to discuss a very important matter of national security. I have it on good authority that my new power source will uh, be in- here we go again. Once you get the carbon out, you can't get it back. Uh, come on, you don't understand me. You have to understand that carbon reversal is the wave of the future. We just take what's already been polluted in the air, and we use it to produce clean energy for the masses. Well, we're not here to discuss that. Don't you understand why we brought you here in the first place? There is a threat of emergency coming down our way. I'm well aware of Beatlemania, oh, but- One cannot simply ignore the monsters at our door. Listen, we can't put our military might behind me. Musicians. Uh, well, I'm afraid I'm have to agree with my friend Stan here, but this is very important, too. Well, then that's what settles it. We'll release all the LSD to the people. Listen, I enjoy the good time just like anybody else, but this is going to affect the populace. Listen, we got a couple bands down the pipeline that are okay, but it won't work until ten years from now when we have more bands. Well, that might be true and all, but this doesn't really feel that appropriate. Man, if only we had eight days a week. Yeah, but that's just music, you know? This is just all music. This has nothing to do with the really serious implication that has to us guzzling gas, putting carbon emissions in the air. I'm just created an event. And we want none of it. Do you understand me? We want none of it from you. Shut up. Stop talking. We don't care about your carbon emission thing. But maybe if you were to talk about Beatlemania or counteractives towards it. Oh, you want me to uh, counteract uh, the Beatles? Well, fine. Let me tell you this one last thing. Son, we're fighting two different wars. We're going to introduce the sitar to the Beatles, and that's how we're going to defeat them. I mean, seriously, who wants to play an instrument with 20 strings? It's ridiculous. Ugh, ungrateful little... Oh, yes. I know you've been through a lot today. You creating a device that reverses carbon emissions, but perhaps we can use that technology. Hi, my name is Stan. It's uh, interesting that you would uh, bring that up. For far too long, we've been guzzling up gas and bringing it up into the atmosphere. Oh yes, I understand that completely. Perhaps, maybe you can reverse music like the Beatles. I'm not saying it'll be easy, but I am saying it'll be fruitful. <laughs>